Finally, have my hands on on the ZTE Z Max Pro for Metro PCS. This phone right now, exclusive Metro PCS phone from ZTE, and this is my unboxing video. So let's gonna find out. Before we start do the unboxing, we're going to have a look on the spec of the phone and see what the box shows over here. And let me call that phone, it's a mid-range killer. So this will be the mid-range killer. We have seen the OnePlus from OnePlus company, they call it flagship killer. And this is, in my opinion, it's a mid-range killer. Let's going to see what we got over here. LTE phone, 6 inch full HD LCD panel, 13 megapixel autofocus, 5 megapixel for the front image stabilization will be digital which is good and 32 gigabytes internal memory 1.5 gigahertz octa-core processor snapdragon 617 and you have fingerprint sensor in that device battery will be uh, re should be uh, not removable and all that stuff and the box it will be similar to any other metro pcs box let me go ahead and grab my knife that is $99. The OnePlus, it's like a $399 flagship specification. Good price, but that is $99, guys. That all the specification only for $99. That is unbelievable. Let's gonna move on the phone itself and have a first look on the phone. Wow. The glass is very shiny and very reflective, I believe. So you get the uh, pines over here, it will be compassive pines. And I believe so those is gonna light up, which is good. So you will have the uh, LED notification lights on the home pine, which is cool. You have proximity sensor over here, that kind of nice. And from the back, that is metallic, guys. That it's fully premium, well made, as you guys can see. That's what I wanna see. High quality a product, that is absolutely high end product this is where they show you where we can put the sim card and the memory card i believe it's one up to 128 gigabytes fingerprint we're gonna test this out and oh man that phone looks gorgeous beautiful let's gonna sit this one on the side and look to the other content that comes in the box we do have the sim ejector tool and manual sim card and nothing really fancy you have a charger brick we're gonna find out but I don't think so the phone that support fast charge and this this time guys this is a USB type C that's not like the regular one so if you have a car charger or something make sure to get this one be replaced or buy the adapter I believe you can just buy the adapter if you don't want to spend a lot of money on the USB C cable and another charger that's all you need to do right now what I'm gonna do we're gonna just go ahead and uh, turn on the phone skip all that activation screen and stuff like that we're gonna get back on the phone to have my first impression on the ZTE Z Max Pro after I unboxed the phone it had two minutes to play in the phone for a little bit so I set up the uh, fingerprint so very much the fingerprint in that phone it's really fast it didn't give me no problem like as much as you want just put your finger and will unlock your phone immediately super fast no problem and one other thing I want to tell you look how the uh, notification slider here over here it's transparent so you can see anything uh, behind which is looks gorgeous looks nice notifications really beautiful the screen guys the screen is really awesome I mean this so much bright right now it's on a maximum brightness because I want you to see it guys I didn't text it on the Sun but in my full review I will definitely the speaker and the whole entire front it's a glass I'm not sure what type of glass they have look to the back of the phone that is actually beautiful so you have this and uh, another thing I want to show you if you go to a sensor box you will see that the phone does support gyroscope that means you can play Pokemon Go or you can use the 360 uh, VR the reason that phone has uh, 1080p because you can use it through the VR which is dope that it's a mid-range killer phone 
mid-range with the flagship specification seriously the only thing that I miss with that phone NFC personally I don't use NFC I don't do payment through my phone so for me it is not a big deal you got FM radio so that is dope not a lot of phones that has FM radio so you don't see this one even with some of the flagship phones that is absolutely nice yeah my first impression about the phone that phone is gorgeous I love it I have no problem so far I will do a review I wanna also do a comparison with some other uh, Metro PCF phones like the J7 and the Stylo 2 Plus so you guys stay tuned for more and this phone from now on I'm gonna call it the mid-range killer phone if you agree leave thumbs up and subscribe more for variety stick thank you so much for watching guys as always i'll see you in my next one